What is good, everybody? Welcome to an Epic My Damn Toys video. Today, ladies and gentlemen, we have some brand new WWE Elite figure images for you guys. We've been breaking it down. We've been talking about it for days and weeks, I feel like. But finally, ladies and gentlemen, we have final product images. They're in stock right now at Ringside Collectibles, WrestlingFigures.com. Go over there. Use the promo code MDTOYS. All of these figures are in stock right now. We're going to run through all of Elite Series 75 and break down all of the images for you guys. Let's pull up the figure. We had no idea what it would look like it is the jeff hardy right here and it looks beautiful guys i'm super excited for these i'm sure loose product images are coming soon they may even be posted before i even get the video finished and if they are i'll try to include them in the video or i'll upload a video right after but these are the inbox images and they are in stock shipping right now but look at jeff hardy right here guys our first jeff hardy with a white tank top it is also a 2002 jeff hardy right here which we knew it would be and it looks so beautiful showcase collector proving one once again, while he is such a reliable source, what a beautiful looking figure, man. The white tank top, the face paint looks great, the half face paint. His face kind of looks, I don't know, it's a good head sculpt. It just kind of looks, I don't know, there's something weird about this angle or something. I feel like it'll be better once it's out of packaging and everything like that. But I am very happy with this figure. I think it looks great. I like the facial hair. The the uh, the paint on the face looks good. The hair looks good. How like short it is there with the purple. You got the great arm paint going down. Great details going down. He even has his necklace included, which is a great detail. And will look great on other figures. I love the white tank top look. This gives us very many options for other figures fix-ups and things like that. I love the arm choice that we're getting. Um, one thing I will point out is that it sucks that he does not have mic holding hands. It looks like he is getting fists and the signature hands instead of mic holding hands, which is unfortunate, but you know what? Still a beautiful looking figure, and I feel like, uh, no, nah, I don't think that's true. Or am I, am I seeing things correctly? It looks like there may be a towel uh, also in his butt, so we may have a towel in there as well. So he comes with a necklace, the J.H. Jeff Hardy shirt that is removable. It is the rubber obviously it's not the t-shirt that we thought we were getting but it still looks great i love the armbands on this thing what a beautiful looking jeff hardy man I, I am super pumped for this one the necklace is just such a great detail i cannot wait until uh, i get this thing in hand i even went and ordered more figures to go along with my ringside full set so i i am super hyped i got another additional two hardys to go with the one that ringside will be sending out so i'm i'm very very hyped for this figure Next up, guys, let's go ahead and take a look at Seth Rollins, guys. Seth Rollins is looking excellent. Three pairs of interchangeable hands. They did go with the basic 102 head sculpt. We felt like they probably would. You know, it makes the most sense. And it is his 2019 Royal Rumble attire, which we knew it would be. Looks great. I, I cannot wait to have this figure in hand. I cannot wait to see what he looks like fully, you know, out of the packaging. But it does look just like we thought it would. I think it looks great. It looks like the deco is applied very nicely. I love that they included the vest. I figured they included the vest. You know, I didn't think that they would just give us the figure with three pairs of interchangeable hands that didn't seem like it would be the legit so they did give us the chicago bears uh 2019 royal rumble seth rollins and it looks great man i cannot wait for this one it's going to be excellent beautiful looking figure nonetheless and it looks excellent i think everything came out right you're probably going to hear me say excellent a lot in this video but you know what brad everything looks excellent so seth rollins looks great i like the sr i maybe the sr could be a little bit bigger if i'm just nitpicking but they, give, they did give us a new vest mold that is a new vest mold. It doesn't have, you know, the chest, you know, pieces on there. They actually did make it one solid piece, so that is very nice to see new tooling with the vest. But the Seth Rollins figure does look great. And now we're going to move on to Kalisto, and Kalisto is going to complete our Lucha House Party. And this figure looks phenomenal, I think. I really like the face paint, not the face paint, but the mask paint, the colors they use for the mask. I love the forearm shivers on this Kalisto. I like all of the details we get. We get the little ratchet thing that goes Goes around and around with the Lucha House Party. You get the t-shirt, and he will go very nicely with our Grand Metalik and Lince Dorado figures. I really love all the blue color, the gold and the red, all tying together down on the knee pads and the kick pads. You can't see all of the details, but I am feeling what they're putting out right here. I love the way this figure looks. Um, really strong Kalisto. I think this is the best Kalisto we've gotten. Of course, we did get the Elite 42. We got the Elite 48, and now we're getting the Elite 75. So this is very sick to see for Kalisto. Very pumped to see what he looks like without the shirt and how he poses around. I can guarantee you this figure is going to pose around really, really nice, and uh, it looks great. So Kalisto is a great-looking figure. Next up, guys, we're going to include the Chase variant Hurricane and the regular version of Hurricane. Now, you guys will notice that the black version does have black knee pads. It has black, uh, you know, uh, black boots, and it does have, uh, it looks like black shoes with, like, some white detailing. So 
the uh, the regular version is on your left and then the chase variant version is on your right and you will see the difference between the two i really do love the chase variant and i don't think ringside is going to send me the chase variant so i i did go ahead and place an order for the chase variant because i love the chase variant i think that the 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 white on the you know the kick pads with the green that's what i wanted with our hurricane figure and they didn't give it to us with the regular version so giving it to us with the chase variant is beautiful so i had to go ahead and order that it also includes some extra deco on the chest so that is another beautiful beautiful look for Hurricane. And he comes with a cloth cape, which is huge. I think that's awesome. So now I'm going to have three different versions of Hurricane in the collection, which is going to be so cool to see him up next to my other Hurricane that you guys have seen on Vindication and stuff like that. That will be excellent to see. But uh, Hurricane looks great. I'm very happy with the way Hurricane looks out. I think it's so cool to see that we're getting a, you know, a real elite Hurricane after we've seen a basic in the past. So um, I'm very hyped for not only the Chase variant version, but the, uh, the regular version. So I think both of them look awesome. Very, very hyped for Hurricane three amazing figures thus far in the set and I think or four I should say including Kalisto but what a great looking Hurricane figure. Um, next up, guys, we're going to take a look at Pete Dunn. Now, Pete Dunn, we already knew what he looked like. We saw, you know, the final product image of him out of the packaging at that little wrestling shop live or whatever that was, that little con over in the UK, I think it was. Um, this figure looks fantastic as well. Um, you know, not the best attire, but he does come with the UK championship. He does come with his inner, uh, his entrance jacket or vest, whatever you want to call that, with the fur coming off of it. It is his uh, black and bronzish, you know, attire which looks great i'm very happy to get an updated pete dunn the head sculpt looks good you know his other figure that we got was sort of i, I don't know it was just you know very early pete dunn it was like 2016 looking pete dunn i think and it was a very early figure so it's nice to get an updated Pete Dunn. You know his longer hair, his scuffier beard, or scruffier beard, and this this looks fantastic as well. So Pete Dunn, Hurricane, Kalisto, Seth Rollins, and Jeff Hardy all look good. And then the final figure in the set is obviously going to be Mandy Rose, and she looks good. One thing we've always we've already talked about with this figure is that she is probably a little bit too skinny. You know Mandy Rose has some meat on her bones, her arms. You know she's got some definition in her arms. Her legs are a little bit bigger too. So that is one thing I will gripe about with this figure is the, she's probably a little bit too skinny for for. Me me personally, I feel like she could be bigger, um, you know, more bulkier, muscular. So uh, that is kind of disappointing, but I still think the figure looks good nonetheless. I like the head sculpt on it. I like everything else about it besides that fact. So um, this full set looks great, man. I think it's a really strong set, Elite Series 75. Definitely go get in on the, you know, on the in stock, man. They're on, they're in stock right now. I bet Jeff Hardy and Seth Rollins are going to go very, very fast. So you definitely want to get in on that as soon as possible. Chase Variant Hurricane, if you want the white boot version, you probably need to go over there as well. I think they're charging 10 extra bucks for the for the Chase variant, but I personally think it's worth it when you think about um, the white boots and the extra deco and stuff. I think it looks pretty good. So I went ahead and got myself one. And then uh, Jeff Hardy looks a absolutely ridiculous, man. Jeff Hardy is looking so good. I can't wait to have that one in hand. And I'm sure these figures are on their way. Hopefully, they'll be here. If they ship today, maybe they ship today. If they ship today, they'll probably be here Monday, if I had to guess. Because, you know, you guys know I probably don't get them first. But um, if they're not here Monday, maybe they'll be here Tuesday. But reviews will start as soon as possible. As soon as I get them, we'll definitely start on the reviews. But I'm super hyped for them, man. Jeff Hardy looks probably the best. Or I'm probably just the most excited for Jeff Hardy. I think the Hurricane, though, looks fantastic. Seth Rollins looks good as well. I know that we're getting another Seth Rollins in Elite Series 78, which we discussed this morning. If you guys want to see, you know, Elite Series 78 and all the figures that are coming for that wave, definitely go check that out. This morning we posted some figures that are announced for Elite Series 78, and we did, uh, you know, we took a look at those figures. But this set looks amazing, guys. Definitely go over to RingsideCollectiblesWrestlingFigures.com. Use the promo code MDTOYS to save 10% so you don't miss out on these figures figures. Um, I, I cannot wait again. As soon as the figures come into stock, we will be putting them up. We will review them. We're going to, you know, do our two and two reviews, and then we're going to break down the set. And then, of course, at the on the last review of the two figures, we will be ranking the set from worst to best, in my personal opinion. I can't wait. It's going to be a super hard freaking set to rank. I really don't know how the hell I'm supposed to rank these figures when all of them look freaking fantastic. But, uh, Jeff Hardy looks great. We called it. 2002 Jeff Hardy Showcase Collector confirmed it. Really great deal. Seth Rollins looks just as good as we thought it would. Included the entrance vest, which we called. The Chase Variant Hurricane looks great with the white and green. 
Pete Dunn looking excellent. We actually get a title this time. Mandy Rose looks great figure. Another double jointed knees women figure to add to the collection. And Kalisto will complete our Lucha House Party. So this is an epic set, guys. Definitely go get in on all of that. But that is going to do it for today's video, guys. I did want to put these images up to you. If they release any more loose images or there's any more news we need to talk about, we'll definitely put them up to, you know, react to them. But I'm so happy they finally released the images of these figures. Go pick them up at WrestlingFigures.com. Use promo code MDTOYS and I will see you guys in the next video. Thank you.